Hi everyone. So in this video we will discuss about Aden called Family Revisor. What it does? It basically export all the families from a Revit project to your local drive, one drive or SharePoint. So how it works? So let's see. I'm just opening Family Revisor. Right here you can see I have opened the Family Revisor in export tab selection should be all categories whatever we need by, by uh, family name and type we can uh, give that thing and we can see all those families are by family name and type if we just need to see the categories only we can see that those things as well so i'm clicking on some families from right here these are the categories of those families like i just want uh, an audition symbols all those families i just want all column families and doors families to be exported in my this path let's see i'm just creating a folder right here okay it's already created in my desktop families so i'm just selecting that folder select folder now that's okay do not bother about backup folder this for uh, creating a backup families right there this option show only not assigned families it shows if we have already exported some families by this add in then we'll check this option so that it will not include those families again now right here you can see save families so i'm clicking on that and save to root folder root folder means this path so i'm clicking on this one save families it is just started after this one we can see right here two more tabs are right there editor and worksheets we'll talk about those uh, two tabs as well in this video let's finish this one first meanwhile we can see uh, if i'll go in that particular folder families right here you can see it has started and you can see the counts are increasing so all the families are uh, what we can say saving right here from the project so that's how it works now oh let me finish yes it is completed now now if i'll go for the second uh, feature that uh, family revisor gives us that is editor what we can do in this one we can search any family from right there like suppose i just want to find is like i have selected right here family name family name means this column's name will be highlighted right here like i just want to search for a zero metric find all it has highlighted me this one now i can replace that name by metric only replace now you can see i have changed the name but it is not updated in the model because when i click on this one now it should be up right here update the model when i click on this one it will be updated in the model so i'll change one more thing right here after that we'll do that thing so i'll go for uh, prefix as well i just wanted to use one dash as prefix and dash to as suffix and all so it will be applied for all if i click on this it will be applied for all as well as if i click on suffix it will be applied on all we can see right here the prefix and suffix we have edited right here we can rename any family as per our project standards that's how we can do that thing uh, right there now if i'll click on upload update model it will be updated in my model as well it's now regenerating the model it's completed now if i'll see in my model as well all the families right there we can see these has one dash as prefix and dash to as suffix so that's the second feature that we have seen right here now if we'll go for the third one okay this is the local file so that's why we cannot use this one and this one we can even uh, change the worksheets create the new worksheets kind of thing we can do
I'll let you know in my separate video about the work such thing of family revisor as well. Thank you for this video guys. In next video I'll explain you about another add-ins as well.